I remember you. What are you doing here? Did the Jedi Council send you? I swear I will expose you if they have. I see. So you have come to join the Sith, as I have. I should have known that would happen, as should the Council. The Council is nothing but a slow and doddering farce, placing all their trust in you. And you failed them, just as you failed Juhani. Do you even remember me? I am Belaya. And it is your murder of Juhani that brought me here. Fortunately, I have learned the power of revenge. That is the whole point. Personally, I think it's wonderful fun. Those fools actually think that if they stand there long enough, I'll let them become a Sith. Idiots. A Sith is not a banther, all endurance and no brains. A Sith would fight for his life, no matter the odds. If these rot grubs are as stupid as they seem, then they deserve their fate. Oh, it is. I wonder which one will be the last stand. Should I tell him, then, that his hopes are in vain, do you think? Hmm. It is a bit boring standing out here all day, however. I think I'll go for some dinner. It will be fun to think of them while I gorge myself. They'll still be here in a... You talk to Meckle? I don't believe...
It is the device given to one who has been accepted into the Academy, but has not yet... If one of the Sith decides you are worthy, you will be... You must be admitted to the Academy. That dis... The final decision, however... Re If you're looking to get into the... What do you want? I'm trying to get into the Sith Academy. Right. <sighs> I wish I knew to tell you the truth. You have to impress one of the Sith, I guess. She's a Twi'lek Sith Master, I hear. Very high rank. She's the one who decides... I really couldn't say. I hear that sometimes she comes out into the colony to drink at the cantina, though. Oh. One of Korriban's primary trade routes went through to you on the Ebon. Greetings, friend. Fellow pilot, are you? What? Oh, just a boring freighter. We've had some pretty steady work here. In case you're forgetting, partner, they don't exactly want us talking about their business. It's in a valley on the surface, beyond. Shows what you know. The Academy. Well, regardless, the Sith don't let anybody near the. Sure. Hey, what's this? Looks like we found ourselves a bit of sport, my friends. This is good. I want to celebrate my acceptance into the Academy. Me too. So how about it, chum? Ready to die? I'm eager to blow off some steam after those tests. That's pretty funny. Why should we be scared of you? Oh, uh, this one doesn't look like a pushover, you know. Maybe we should reconsider. Yeah, okay. You just keep out of our way next time, you. Once you become a Sith, you can do anything! You can feel the power coursing through you! None of your fools can compare to me! Please! You're jealous! You're jealous of my power! You think you deserve this medallion, don't you? I have the power to do anything! Kudu, Tuni Rama na praka donko tsercha, chupa tanki. Sniveling fool! You would ever belong beside me in the academy. Kill you now and save us the trouble. What's this? It seems I have an audience. Look, Jedi, just keep walking. I am a Sith now. My power is supreme! Prepare to die! <laughs> Ha ha ha! 
medallion that marks you as one of the chosen. I do not recognize you, however. Have you been accepted into the Academy very recently? I see. And who might your friends be? Ah, I trust you will be responsible for ensuring your slaves are not disruptive, then. Hmm. Suddenly I'm a convincing slave, am I? Maybe you should have left me on the ship. I always think we should leave you on the ship, old man. Don't get smart mouth with me, young man. You're not too old to put over my knee. You'll want to bring your medallion to Euthora Pan. She is the one who brings all selected students into the academy for their training. I believe she can be located within the cantina here in the colony. I suggest you go to her while she is still there, student. that I am busy human. Oh, I see you have a medallion. Where did you get it? I see. How very enterprising of you. Though that is not the normal way that we select our students for the Academy. We Sith do encourage such independent thinking. You may even be a suitable candidate to join us. That is what you wish, I take it, to become a Sith. Ah, oh, so you are just another hopeful after all. Or are you? There is something odd about you that I cannot place. Obviously you are a Jedi. One who is very strong in the Force, it seems. So were you a part of the Order for very long? Did they train you? Perhaps not. Perhaps all the difference in the world. Either way, you possess enough raw power to intrigue me greatly. With that kind of power, you could become a great Sith. Perhaps, if I let you. Does that interest you? Ah, oh, good. Exactly the sort of answer I was hoping for. I will take you to the Academy, and we shall see if you are ready to join the ranks of the Sith. I have only one other question. These companions of yours, they will not be coming with you, I presume. My hearing's not so good. I'm just pleased my nice master doesn't beat me so much anymore. Yes, sir. There's something odd about this servant of yours. No matter. Make sure they don't disturb your training or cause trouble. 
You are responsible for them. Now, are you ready to go to the Academy? Then let us leave. The Master of the Academy awaits you. Greetings, prospective students. It appears we have a late entry. Who do you bring before me, Uthura? A young human bristling with the Force? A human that has had some training, it seems, Master Uthar. Very promising, I think. I met this one in the colony. Unworthy, if you ask me. That I'll judge for myself, thank you. Tell me, human, what do you know of the ways of the Sith? What preconceptions has your mind been polluted with? A diplomatic answer, if not the core of the matter. Our power is obvious. The question in truth goes much deeper than the surface. The Jedi equate the light with goodness and strength, and the dark with weakness and evil. That is their tradition, and it is truly no surprise that they cling to it for comfort. We, however, do not treat the Force as a burden. We treat it as a gift, a thing to be celebrated. We use it to acquire power over others. And why should we not? Because the Jedi say we should not. We are as the Force is meant to be. The Jedi would hide that from you. They would tell you the dark side is too quick, too easy. All so that they need never challenge the passions that lie within them. Joining with us means realizing your true potential. It means not stifling yourself solely for the sake of hidebound shamans and their antiquated notion of order. Be what you were meant to be. What say you, Lasho? Are you ready to learn the secrets of the dark side? Dare you? I dare, Master Uthar. I am ready. Brash and fiery, as expected. Turn that passion to your advantage, child. What of you, Meikl? Are you ready? I am, Master. More than ready. I sense much anger within you, young one. That is good. That will provide you power. And Shardan, what of you? I am always ready. I see. You had best gather your wits for the trial ahead, boy, or you will not last. And you, young human, does this interest you? Are you ready to learn more of what I speak? And so shall it be. Now then, all of you five recruits have shown a degree of facility with the Force. You all have the potential to become true Sith. Only one of you, however, will succeed. The one who succeeds will be admitted to the Academy as a full Sith. All others must wait until next year and try again, if you survive. As Master Uthar said, none of you are true Sith yet. For that to occur, one of you must do enough of worth, gain enough prestige to be selected. What is an act of worth? You must learn that for yourselves. Remember that you are competitors here. Fight for your destiny, or go home. If you wish to gain a lead over your competitors, the first of you to learn the Code of the Sith and tell me of it will be rewarded. The rest is for you to discover. Welcome to the dark side, my children. Your one chance at true greatness lies here. Ah, there you are. My... Absolutely. By my estimate, as a matter of fact, I am so certain of that that I'm willing to offer you an opportunity of the once-in-a-lifetime variety. Good. I do so adore someone who's willing to take a chance. As I said, you're no doubt going to be the one whom Uthar chooses to become a Sith. With my help, of course. Once that occurs, he will take you into the Valley of the Dark Lords, to the tomb of... There you and I will be alone with him. The perfect time to... The tomb is an ancient ruin on the surface that was visited years ago by Darth Revan and Darth Malak. They discovered a star... You don't say! Well, the Master Lo Reaching that map, as they did, is part of the final test. At any rate, it is not the tomb that is important. 
I suppose you could do that. Even the hint of betrayal from his pupil and Uthar would move to eliminate me. But this is a very good opportunity for you. you could, do you believe Uthar would not be aware of this? He would quickly figure out what you have to gain by betraying him, and would tell Master Uthar what you wish. Where I'm so glad you see it, my way. I will begin to make preparations for you. I have been involved in the work there over the last couple of years, but not often. Most of the ex Nobody wants to talk about this Not unless you are accompanied. We could learn much about the history of... Perhaps we could learn more about the origin of the Force. As you wish. I can help you understand it. Peace is a lie. There is only passion. Through passion, I gain strength. Through strength, I gain power. Through power, I gain victory. Through victory, my chains are broken. The Force shall free me. Simple words, yet easily misunderstood. Would you care for... I am not surprised. The Force... You have... Oh, uh, hello. I don't remember seeing you here before. I... oh. Uh, yes, my master always says I'm too trusting, too willing... Uh, no. No, I, I really can't. Uh, Oh, I know that. I mean, you aren't yet, but you intend to be. I mean, you're just like everyone else here. Well, I, 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 I did. I, I shouldn't trust. I just don't feel like the one here. I thought maybe I did at first, but now I, I don't know. But where would I go then? But what? Uh, yeah, maybe you're right. Uh, I'll go and tell Master Uthar that I'm not ready for this. Maybe it won't be so bad. There are some students in hiding that refuse to follow an order. You? I remember you from the colony. I can't believe you actually made it. A duel. Fine. You run along and get ready. You? I re Just figure that out, did you? And what do you have to brag about? You're all right. Trying for the... That's true. I had no idea you were coming for the Academy when I met you in the colony, though. The name's Chardin. Didn't I tell you that? I don't work or play well. I remember you. You want to challenge me? To a do- I guess we'll meet eventually. It's a bad year to try and become a Sith, you know. I've... You think I would tell you? I could, but what would be the point? You hanging around still? Well, you're off... <laughs> Funny.
Maybe you can do better than I. I'm trying to get him to tell us where his weapon cache is hidden. So far, all the se If I bring his drug threshold to... Certainly. Uh, just don't kill him. If you manage to get the location of his cache... What have you done? I told you not to put the prisoner into shock, didn't I? Ah, I may as well take this fool and dump him somewhere. my way. I don't... Hmm. Another hopeful wandering about the academy? <laughs> I doubt that. 
Greetings, young one. You have much to do yet. You have gained little press. Then finish the code as I peace is through passion, through string, through power, through victory. The force shall free. Yes, good. You have indeed learned the code of the Sith. Speak, tell me then, true or false? It is our passion that fuels the... Well done. I will test you no more. You know the code. Very impressive. Go now. You have done well, but you have not impressed me enough to declare... Oh? What is my apprentice? I see. It is good that you have come to me with this information, young one. It is a bit... ironic that Euthura has begun her plotting... I have been aware of her growing ambitions for some time, and had in fact already decided to remove her. Normally, the one who gains the most prestige would engage in a final trial. Two of the students would fight. This time, it will be Euthura who battles. Though, perhaps it will be you who combats her. Yes, perhaps so. This is what you can do. Give this pad to Adrenus. He will put some poison in her bath. This will weaken Euthura for that final test, making her an easy target. Rather generous of me, don't you think? Mm, this For coming to me with this information and betraying your foolish trainer, I feel you are worthy of prestige, young one. You wish to know more about me, do you? And why would I indulge your idol? I strived many years to hone my power, until I was able to drive out my predecessor and... There is nothing else you need to know. Do Very well. You have impressed me. Thank <laughs> you. 